What's up, everybody? Man, it's your boy, Mr. Duga, coming at y'all with another video, man. And today I'm going to talk about last night's baseball game. You had the Atlanta Braves losing to the Cincinnati Reds 5 to 2, yo. <sighs> Gosman, Gosman, Gosman. <laughs> I mean, after his first start against the Washington Nationals, where he just looked absolutely incredible out there striking out a lot of people i think he only gave up like one run after that man it's been downhill you know he goes to philly gave up a grand slam and then last night just gave up five runs early on and you know um offense didn't really have it last night is you know um i didn't really like the lineup at the end man facing the right hand uh facing the left hand with you know even though he hit a home run last night riley hit a home run but um, we had Riley, Flowers, and, you know, out there along with Camargo. And that's kind of like our weakest lineup, you know. But, and we didn't score many runs last night. We hit a, you know, Riley hit a solo when Acuna hit a solo a bomb <laughs> solo. But um, we fell short, man, and Gosman didn't look pretty good at all last night. What makes me wonder, man, is um, is Fo uh, Fo Fotinevich. Will we call him back up pretty soon? You know, he was really struggling for us early this year also. But the thing with him is, you know, we know he has all-star stuff as he was an all-star last year. It's just, did he, they say he's pitching actually pretty decent down in, uh, in AAA right now. So, you know, maybe he makes that next start and that fit starter role, man. Or if we roll Gosman out there again. Now, granted, is is not as important because as far it's important for the regular season. Obviously, in the postseason, you ain't gonna have a fit starter, but you know your fit starter is probably gonna just go to the bullpen. But you know, I mean, you you know, we our lead with the Nationals is six games. You know, you want to kind of just put this division away, man, and you don't want to just feel like okay, yeah, it's great to know we are gonna win four games, but then when a fit starter just wave the white flag, like all right, we know we are gonna lose tonight. You know, we, you don't want to have that mentality. So you need a guy to go out there and give you some good innings, man. One positive note from last night, man, is the bullpen looked pretty good, yo. Chris Martin, our new addition from the um, from the Rangers, went out there and had a really strong inning, yo. He he looked very good. You know, we didn't see Melanson yet or, um, or obviously I'll close the Shane Green, but you know, Martin looked at really good out there pitching, and I, I'm excited about this bullpen getting better going forward. You know, it was tough last night because our fit starter was out there, and we didn't have the lead at all during the game. But, um, you know, Keiko going tonight, you know, the next few games, you know, you got Keiko, then Turan, then Soroko, then Freed. Um, I'm looking forward, you know, to seeing this bullpen, you know, um, that's the one good thing is last night, the bullpen, I don't think they allowed any runs. So, um, we get good solid starting pitchers from our top four guys. You know, it's, it's, it's promising to see that we might finally have a bullpen that could, you know, get the job done and hold it down, man. Plus our lineup, man, obviously going, we gonna have like flowers out there that much, you know, um, and Riley. You know, and Camargo whenever Swanson comes back, yo. But um, yeah, tough loss. You know, five to two, man. Um, but you want to feel good about the next. You know, you hope to take three out of four in this series. You know, um, with Keiko and Turan going on the mound, and can we please finally give Keiko some run support? <laughs> like Keiko be pitching good, but we give him no run support whatsoever. Like we give Freed all the run support in the world, which is great. But we don't give Keiko no run support, man. Can we finally give Keiko some run support, yo? Um, started tonight. But um, but with that being said, man, that's all I got for y'all today. Appreciate y'all checking out the video. Go on, hit the like button and give me a subscribe, man. I'm going to have Atlanta Braves content throughout the year. Also, yo, on Tuesday at 4 p.m. Central, I will do a live Q&A. You could come on, ask me anything. Um, I'll try to answer all your questions and give you a shout out, yo. Y'all have a blessed one. Chop on.